Hello and welcome to something we haven't seen for a while. I'm doing some Silver Crown at Bristol. This is a combo I've actually never done before. And it's been a while since I've done some Silver Crown racing. But I am feeling pretty good. I'm, I'm excited. Uh, I think I'm probably going to... Do I qualify? I'm actually still undecided. <laughs> um, I think I'll have to qualify. Um... Because I think it's going to be really hard to pass. Um, thankfully, what's really cool is Tracy is in here and he shared his setup with me, which was really nice of him. He didn't have to do that. Uh, I was just going to just run the, the fixed, but uh, considering he had the fastest time <laughs> in, the, in the practice, warm up and everything, uh, I have the tools to make something out of this, but the skills will probably be lacking. So I have no excuse other than my own abilities, but that's okay. I'm not going to try to drive over my head and spin out qualifying like I almost did just then. Um, <laughs> you know, all that good stuff. You know what? I'm not going to qualify. It looks like a lot of people are qualifying. I'm down to 13th. I'm just going to go ahead and do this. I changed my mind. I was probably going to be in the back anyway, so... Thank you, uh, Tracy, for sharing your queue setup, but I will not be using it, unfortunately. Just going to go right to the race setup. That's fine. I'm happy with that. Uh, I'm happy with this decision. Uh, I'm just going to take it easy. Try to relearn the Silver Crown a little bit. And uh, this seems like it could be a pretty tough combo. So. You know, no expectations. I'd just like to make it to the end clean, and I think I'd be pretty happy. It looks like, let's see, 3, 5, 8, 13. So they might still be qualifying, I'm not sure. I'd like to start at the very back so I can leave some room, and then if there's a big pile up right off the start, <laughs> I can avoid being in it. But usually Silver Crown's pretty clean, so hopefully we won't see that. But I really don't know what to expect. Never done this before uh, at this at Bristol. So it could be just about anything. Some names we recognize, of course, as you see the lineup here. And a lot of names I just recognize because they run Silver Crown. So the Silver Crown names. <laughs> so that's always fun. All right, sweet. I'm the only one that didn't qualify. So I do get to start at the very back, just how I want it. And uh, just waiting on Lewandowski, who's doing his second lap right now, probably. So we'll probably be able to start here. Yeah, awesome. What a great group of guys all getting ready. No waiting necessary. Good stuff, good stuff. You'll be lining up on the inside. Closed, pit road is closed. <laughs> Last lap. I really just don't want to crash. This thing can, like, snap so easily on exit. I've noticed. And, uh, who knows how it'll evolve over time. You too, Joe. Could get looser. Could get, uh, it could stabilize a little bit. But I, uh, I'm hoping to find out what it does without like spinning fine? or hitting the wall. Oh, wow. Tracy on pole, looking pretty good. Hopefully I'll be able to hold a line when he comes to lap me, too. I find another thing. Tough split. A little nervous, but happy to be here in the Silver Crown series again. I don't, I'm not ready for this yet. I love running these cars, just don't always get the chance, but it's Monday night here, yeah, and of course they have their Monday night time slot. And I was going off, so I was like, all right, let's do it. the last second, I guess. 
for everyone to grid. Here we go. The entire set's in this race. We're going the whole way. 100 laps, but we will make it on fuel, of course. These things are basically gas tanks with wheels. In the inside column. Which, if you're thinking that's the safest thing I've ever heard, you're correct. I'm so glad I get to start in the back. I'm just here to have fun driving the car. Now, no expectations of finishing well. Just gonna enjoy myself. And, uh... I'll take whatever I can get. And if that's nothing, all right. I wonder if they're going to want the bottom or the top when they're lapping me. I guess I'll just have to keep an eye on where guys are running. One left to green. Someone not grid. Looks like there's like an empty spot on the right side. Yeah, where's P14? Starting the pits? Maybe. I see on my relative, I don't see any uh, P14. Oddly enough, I think he was supposed to start on the outside of the uh, 10 car in front of us, maybe. Get no, he's supposed to be on the outside green. of the 14, I think, and the 15 got to move up. I think that's what happened. Alright, getting ready to go. They're off. Go, go, go. Green flag, green flag. Some of them. <laughs> B sixteen. Can't be the guy that's just oh they're running into each other already. Right in front of me. <laughs> Not going to be the guy that doesn't qualify and then plows through. Happy back here. And I will be careful if I feel the need to get by anybody. Falling back a little bit. Shit, I'm sorry there. God damn it. Oh, 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 oh. oh. oh that was the nasty Nico. No, Tracy was in it. I don't think that was on you, Panic. Oh, man, that sucks. Solid. Right, now open. It's open. Uh, I hope so. I was not intending to do that. Tracy, hope you're good. I think he is. He's in the pits. No, why did it have to be Tracy? He was so nice to me. <laughs> I was close, Brett. Holy crap. <laughs> well, shoot. Do, uh, caution laps count? That's a question. Yep, Tracy's done. That sucks. Damn it. He, uh, Sounds like the nine oh, fault for that one, or at least calling an himself. That's terrible for Tracy. Jeff Racing. Gotta shake it off and redo her. Well, closed. Pit road is closed. We're under caution. Pit's closed. We will be P15 then, I guess. One person didn't grid. One Tracy got wrecked. Wait, did? I'm confused now. But wasn't there a person that didn't grid? I don't know. I might be actually insane. Thank you, bud, my brother. One left to green. Okay, Colton, get ready. Race oh, yeah, single the file in the series. There aren't many <laughs> series that do this. I like it every time that. This might help things stay clean. When everyone's single file and... And uh, things get probably ready, get spread get out a bit here. Pace 
Right, carries off. You're going? Green, green flag, green flag. flag. Sure, I don't uh, get loose on throttle. B15. Hey, maybe uh, by driving it easy, it'll actually be nice to the tires, too. Maybe that'll pay off for us later as well. You never know. Definitely easing it in around here. Be very gentle on uh, exit as well. So I don't snap the car loose. That's my fastest lap today. How about that? <laughs> really pushed yet. Probably has a lot to do with it. The car in front lap time is at 13.7. 15th place. Oh, that guy's almost in the wall up there. I really gotta keep my eyes open. It's hard to avoid wrecks here at Bristol sometimes. Especially in this car, you can't slam on the throttle. It will, like, turn sideways on you. You've just done a 13.9. Seems like everyone's got it together. You've just done a 13.8. You know, at one time they used to have trouble racing this car here because uh, some weird issues where I don't know if it was like a netcode issue or something, but side by side cars would run into each other. The netcode was really bad or something like that. I remember a while ago that was a thing he was talking about. I think they've since fixed that. 12 goes loose. I think they've since fixed that issue. 12 might have some hot tires. Your last lap time was at 13.9. Oh wow, the 12 is having issues. A little nervous. Just gonna be patient and uh, if I can get around, find a way. Able to get around them, that's good stuff. We made a pass. What a day. I feel accomplished already. Close racing up ahead, I'm keeping my eye on. I'll also be keeping an eye on that relative in case the leaders come around. They're not quite on the relative yet, though. Hopefully, we can avoid being a lap down, but that's going to be a tough task. I'm sure, they're pretty darn fast up there. It seems like the wall might be the place to run. Look, I'm watching them up there. They are right Tell by the wall. If you want in when you're clear, let me know. Maybe you can have the spot there. Alright. This is pretty fun. This is just fun to drive. Silver Crown's always just a great time driving it. Feeling pretty good here. Like I said, maybe uh, by easing it through right now, maybe we'll start speeding up later. Whoa, the 15 got sideways. Seeing really close to the wall. Keeps it out of it, though. Oh, he's getting really close, though. He's making me pretty nervous. I don't know if I really want to follow him. <laughs> uh, he's going to be 
cutting it that close. So he's going to end up right on my steering wheel. He hits it. Not really using a brake. I don't know if maybe I should be. Maybe a little bit of brake entry here. Probably would help. But I'm going to take that high line anyway. I'm not sure how we will do it though. Oh, oh, oh! It's uh, spinning a little bit. I'm gonna hit the brakes for him. Very loose on throttle. How do I make a pass? Good question. I'm surprised we haven't seen the leaders on the relative yet. Oh my god, he's getting loose. I'm so afraid to even get alongside him. That was a 14.3. Set something up. See, he does that every time. Every time I go to get a run on him, he gets oh, loose on throttle. Still there. He's going to run into me, isn't he? He's going to get loose Clear on out, throttle out, when I'm on his inside. Still there. Hold uh, outside is clear. I don't know if the inside pass is going to work. I'm going to get to his outside, though. That seems also not something that's going to happen. That lap was at 14.2. We got the 12 catching up because I can't get by this guy. We are just in a traffic jam. It's in the, f the 15 up there now. Very close to the wall. Very slow, very Ooh, slow. Oh my god, where'd he go? Clear. You've just done a 14.3. Hey, we passed him! Rejoice! Now we're behind the 15. Outside. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Clear. We'll get past outside. him. I don't want to cut him off. There we go. All right. Don't run into me, please. All right. We made another pass. Passes for days here today. That lap time was 14.3. What a good time. Let's see if we can even move forward some more. With that. Was that 14.2? I don't know if we're catching this 10 now. It's looking pretty good. Where are we deficit wise? Maybe we can track it and see how we're doing. Maybe check our progress. So at the line, he's about 1.1. Let's see how that changes over time. Cup time's pretty consistent, P12. That high line is where we want to be. At least at this point. 14.3. Oh, you might, you might be in the wall. That was really close. Tight there. Oh, weight jacker's a thing in this car, isn't it? Can we use that? Do we use that? It is getting a little tight. It's 
always loose on exit though, so I don't know if I want to attempt fake too much. That lap time was 14.2. That might help us. Yeah, it's too tight right now. We gotta, we gotta work on this thing. Let's see. It's opposite direction, right? So four to the right. Find out if it's it tighter or looser. Now, the gap in front is now 0.8. I can't tell. Oh, I think no. That's definitely looser. Okay. Okay, now we're cooking. I'm gonna look so ah. silly. Uh oh. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. We're on. Man, I just can't anything. No caution. Whatever did happen. Oh, there's Lewandowski on our relative. Come back, Lou. Knew we'd see that eventually. The gap in front is now 0.8. Lots of green laps here. That's always impressive with how uh, uh, how difficult this is. The way we can uh, keep it green here in this series. That lap time was 14.4. Almost uh, mess with the weight jacker even more, but don't want to spin out. Man, that guy hits really close to the wall. I don't know if he's doing that on purpose, but like if he's like cutting it that close on purpose, that's pretty impressive. I think we're catching him though. We got two and a half seconds behind us. Lewandowski's five seconds back as the leader. Let's see if we can stay on the lead lap, but if this goes green in the end, I don't think that's happening. I think it's very loose. The gap behind is now 2.8 seconds. Outside. It's low. Still there. Clear outside if you want it. Car outside. Cleared him, but I'm not cutting in front of him. Clear high. There we go. Alright, made the pass. Moving forward. Still losing to the leader. But that shouldn't be surprising. He is the leader after all. Feels like it's getting faster. It might be that fuel burning off. Finished up lap sixty five. Been a great green flag run here. Windshield off a little bit. Got some dirt and dust. Screen. What do they call it? Window tear off. Yeah. The gap behind is now 0.9. I think I'm kind of getting the hang of it. Windowski's not catching too much. Uh oh. Lap traffic. I thought we had a wreck for a second. Just lap traffic, though, I think. You've just done a fourteen point three. Happy with that. We didn't get a top ten. Be great. 
I am the number five. Like that's pretty. That's a pretty good field. Like three point five k strength of field. That's pretty good. All the fastest drivers run Silver Crown. Join Silver Crown today. It's my advertise <laughs> advertising attempt to get more people in this series. We recommend it. It's a lot of fun to drive. If you're worried about the participation, guaranteed race on Monday nights. I just wish I could uh, join it more often. The gap in front is now 1.4. Ooh, okay, that was a loose moment. Bye, Gil. My car is destroyed. Oh, car is destroyed, oh, somebody says. It's James, he's also a frequenter of the Silver Crown series. Is that somebody we will be able to catch? The gap in front is now 1.5. Looks like he's right up there. What's a low line doing? Meh. <laughs> Hard to say. I think I still like the line I've been running. Yeah, that's better, I think. Almost definitely. That lap was at 14.4. The gap ahead is now 1.6 seconds. Don't spin it. A little bit lighter. Still can't see Lewandowski back there. I do want to keep an eye on that. Obviously, it's to uh, be ready when he gets here, but I just I want to know where I should be running on track to. I'll give you the highlight, Rich. They have a stack up up ahead. James, I think, has the broken car. They are having trouble getting by him. All right, Colton. The next car is both here. The actor both here in front is now 1.1. That was at 14.4. Definitely have to keep an eye on that up ahead. In case there's a mistake, trying to get by him. Coming up on you, they're not a fight. Thank you. Both of you. I was thinking down low. Profit, okay. okay. I think he's down low, that's what it looks like. No, just for racing, make sure. The gap to both here ahead is now 0.7. We'll back off. Shouldn't be any trouble just uh, backing off for him. He might even, uh, if he's got a big enough lead, which I think he might, he might just hang out back there. Who knows? Side by side battle up ahead, I have to watch out for. This is tough racing. Even just uh, driving this thing on your own. Just is back there pretty much now. It's definitely running a low line. Slow car download. Uh oh, it's happening up there. We're crashing, I think. You go. The ground by. That's good consistency. Keep it up. You've just done a 14.4. Go high. 
Go on, Lewandowski. <laughs> no, he does not like seeing that as the leader. Well, that was interesting. We got a spot out of that, whatever did happen. Where do you want me, higher or low? Oh. I believe, thank you. And we get around one more guy. I'm gonna have to do it on the high side, I think. That's the only place I've got speed. Running out of time, but we are side by side. He's trying to pinch me or something. Oh, don't get the wall. I got really close to the wall there. Left. You got about five laps of fuel left. Right down low. Car inside. Clear. Good one, Tommy. Good race, guys. That was crazy. <laughs> Almost got him. P9. Okay, Good one, Tommy. Good race. Well There's the flag. Gotta go P9. back and watch it, Thomas. Great job. Good you race. did really well. Almost got him, but. I in the bottom the whole time. Race could win. It just kept saying the leader is 14 2, 14 2, 14 2. Hey, that was great. We got P9. Congrats, Tom. Good run, uh, Rich. Woo. Yeah, good run, Joe. Had some action there at the end, even. That was an awesome race. This is the first time I made it in the top split when it was good. Kind of curious what the tires are looking like. This is what we had. So we go from 17th, dead last, to 9th. We move forward pretty good, stay out of any trouble, and get a 0x. And uh, I'm happy with that. We'll lose an estimated 28i rating, but I think I finished about as good as I could have hoped for. So I will take that for sure. Let's uh, go ahead and see what happened. See what happened to Tracy, for example. He unfortunately didn't get the race very long. A little bit of a rear ending near the start. Oh, no. Wow, that tiny, tiny contact. It just absolutely destroyed him. I mean, he's pretty far up the track. That's for sure. Hmm. It looked like he just didn't get any turn. Like, it was real tight for him, maybe, from mid-corner to exit, and it didn't quite turn down as much. And then just the slightest of taps there, since Tracy on the wall, and at the end of his day, early. It's no good. Lands on his wheels, but that thing's destroyed, I'm sure. Yeah. And then we're going to go all the way to 25, lap 25, into 26. The number 10 gets in the wall. Ooh, some wheel touch there. Sure. You really need to see that one. Oh, the 15 loose, end of the wall. And then the 12 got a piece of it. Might have been what they were exclaiming about. Lap 60. 
Ooh. Very scary moment. At some point, the 7 gets damage that slowed him down real bad. Oh, wow. Really bad netcode. Gets his tire. He's up in the wall. And that's the damage that uh, sent him back to us. And our undamaged but equally slow car. <laughs> 67, 10's getting the wall. P2 getting it a little bit. Oh, scary moment. We figure it out. All on the straightaway. Another one on lap 80, maybe? Oh, wow. I can't believe they held on to that. Almost had ourselves a late restart. They kind of hooked the wheels there after the two gets into the wall. I can't believe they didn't wreck that. And, like, they're still all stacked up and everything. There. Or, like, <laughs> doing side draft or something, it looks like. I think he's just unsettled, though, and then he gets into the two. He was having trouble holding on to it. I can't believe... There's so many near wrecks that weren't wrecks here, and then... Now the lap car getting into him. Oh, wow. And then he does crash. This didn't bring out a, a yellow. That's wild. We actually beat the two. I didn't even know. I know we gained spots at some point. I didn't know who it was, though, and it looks like that's what it was. And uh, that's the end of the race. So we get uh, to finish ahead of some guys we definitely shouldn't have, like Tracy and Derek and the number two there, thanks to uh, just starting in the back and being really patient and slow. <laughs> and uh, we'll finish mid-pack. But had a fun time doing it. So, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed some Silver Crown. I sure did. And I, I hope I will see you next time. And uh, whatever's coming up next. Have a good one. And as usual, I forgot the results. <laughs> Here's the results page.